Hello YouTube, um, this is Del Mods. Um, guys, before we get this tutorial started, I did this video earlier, but the audio fucked up. So, or not the audio, but the video fucked up. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so with that being said, guys, today's tutorial is going to be how to get a patch um, on MW2 on OFW consoles. Now, I've told you guys in the past that I will bring, or I promised you guys, um, a tutorial on how to do this as soon as I found out how to do it without a patch. Or a CID, sorry. Um, and I did. Uh, so that's that's pretty much that, and I want to bring you guys this. So, let's go ahead and get into it. The guys, the requirements you're going to need is a PKG viewer, um, which will be in the download description. You're going to need a SFO uh, editor, also be in the description for you guys. And you're going to need PX Lite, will be also be in the description. Um, now with that being said, first things what you guys want to do um, is you want to go on your PS3 and you want to make a backup of your console. So you want to format your utility data and then make a backup. Um, and guys, after that is done, um, basically you just want to plug your USB in your computer and you're going to get a, a folder uh, such as this on your USB. You just drag it on your desktop. Just drag it on your desktop. And uh, once you have that, um, now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and... Uh, now you're done on the desktop. Now what you're going to do is go ahead and open up PKG Viewer and you want to take this OFW pat or OFW update and put it in here and you're just going to right click and you want to uh, extract the source. I'm not going to do it because it takes a long time um, and I have it right here. So with that being said, after that's done, you guys are good. Now all you want to do is you want to click inside this folder right here, click inside this and you want to drag the patch of your choice into the user directory. Um, which is this right here. So I'm going to be using Infinity Light patch. It's the one I always use when I play MW2 along with a couple uh, RTM tools. So it's going to be Del Mods folder, MW2, Infinity Light. And you basically just want to copy this um, and paste it. And you want to click uh, replace. If you're on Windows 7, it's going to play move and replace. Just click that. Um, and after that's done, you can exit off that. You don't need this anymore. Now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and you want to load up PX Exploit. Oh shit! Sorry, I already have it open. Um, don't need this. Um, basically, you just want to hit uh, Extract PKG. You want to load, load the backup. It's going to be your uh, shit D uh, desktop. You want to go to the thing I told you guys, the beer bags is back up that I told you to uh, put in the, um, drag on your guys' desktop. Just going to click, double click on that. Now what you're basically going to do is you just want to wait till it to read the numbers. Um, let's go ahead and wait for that. There we go. Now basically what you just want to do is you want to hit enter package. And basically what you guys are going to do here is you're going to go to the PX light uh, folder wherever it's located on your computer you know mine's on my desktop so I'm gonna go to desktop and then I'm gonna go to my OFW folders um, PX Lite which is there and guys remember I told you to make a new folder called new um, no I didn't actually tell you that sorry um, so back it up a little bit guys um, in, in PKG viewer um, or PKG not viewer why do I keep saying viewer balls um, and PKG exploit basically that oh, you're gonna have all this but this new folder so basically what you guys want to do is you want to create a folder called new click in there you want to create a new folder called dev underscore HDD zero you want to go ahead and click in there and then basically what you want to do is you can click right in here click a new folder call it game um, and now what you guys want to do is you want to drag the patch that we made inside this folder um, so you just want to drag, and you want to replace it. It's not pro well, it's probably not going to be in there for you guys, so you'd, I mean, just delete it if it was, and put that one in there. So that's that, and you guys are good. Um, now back to this part. Basically, now you want to go to PX Exploit New Dev Underscore Game. You want to click your game that we had in there, right there. And now, basically, what you guys want to do is you want to get your account ID using the SFO. 
Um, if you guys don't know how to get the user ID, I will show you right now. So basically, you just want to go to this. You want to go to SFO Editor. I thought I already had it open, to be honest with you. Laws. Sure in the hell I did. I did have it open already. Um, basically, you want to browse. Um, desktop. SFO. You want to click open. You want to copy the account ID. Just want to put it in there. And you want to hit patch and go. Um, now, guys, you're going to let this um, do its thing. It's going to take a little bit, so I'm going to go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys when I am back or when it's done. So, we'll see you guys there. Alrighty, guys. Um, now that it's done, you basically just want to see where it's it put it at, put the save, which is mine, users, a desktop, and then it's going to be right there. So, you just going to hit OK. Um, you can go ahead and close out of all of this. You no longer need it all. You no longer need this. Um, you can keep the PKG. That's a French PKG. Um, you no longer need this. Trash that. Um, and that's his SFO, so it's going to go with him. Um, okay, so guys, basically what you want to do is on your guys' USB, in R, not in the USB, but the desktop, you're going to have a folder called this. You may have a folder that's called like PS3, uh, Backup, Exploit, and in these files. Um, so basically you just want it to, uh, after you have that, you basically just want to go into the one we just made. Um, you want to delete these though, the .bk files though. So you delete these. And now what you want to do is you want to drag these files over and replace them with your old ones. Let's hit move and replace. Uh, now after that guys you can go ahead and safely remove your uh, flash drive from your computer um, Go to the ps3 go to uh, System settings and go to backup and you want to hit restore and now you guys have an mw2 patch and it's perfect um, Now with that being said guys, I hope you enjoy this tutorial Again, if you want if you want to see any of the games that you can't um, actually figure out what to do on Comment down below and like this video. Um, this has been Del Mods, and peace out, guys.